What are the three best free 3D printing softwares for dentists? Um, hey, I'm Dr. Chris Griffin, founder of the 3D Printing Association for Dentists, and this is the video that helps you understand how 3D printing can benefit your practice. So what are the three free best 3D printing softwares for dentists, okay? Uh, and uh, uh, hey, real quick, before we get started, um, you know, this video series is, we're really uh, serious about reaching as many dentists as we can because we really believe in 3D printing. So if you will subscribe to this channel, if you're interested into this, if you're watching this video, we're gonna have a lot more videos coming out, so you'll see the ones as soon as they update. And also, hey, if you don't mind, if you give us a thumbs up, it's easier for more dentists to see us. So we'd love to see that too. Okay, so let's talk about free dental softwares for 3D printing. Now, have you, you know, if you know me, I love free, right? Um, and some softwares are, are free or near free, and some are very expensive, okay? And they all have their pluses and their minuses, but we wanna talk about the free ones, and, and primarily because once you've invested in a 3D printer or a 3D printer system, you've invested a lot of money, right? Some printers are very expensive. Some printers are $30,000. Some printers are $15,000. Sometimes you can get a, a really good printer package for ten dollars or $11,000. I've even seen printers that do a, an okay job on some things for two and $3,000. It just is a big range, but no matter what you purchased, you certainly have made a big investment, okay? And so you've got a big investment in that. You've got a big investment in, in time and in making your dental practice uh, accept the new protocols and stuff. What you don't need is a big expense in software. And sometimes a big expense in software, the gift that keeps on giving, right? So you pay them, maybe you pay a yearly fee or a monthly fee on top of the big front end fee and it's always updating. So I hate that. So what are three standbys that you can really count on? Okay, number one, you know, if you know anything about 3D printing, you're probably familiar with Mesh Mixer. Mesh Mixer is a, is a software from a company called uh, Autodesk. They do, Autodesk is a huge, you know, it's a very, like they were built primarily for, for engineers and architects and stuff, and they do tons of 3D modeling, like online modeling of, of stuff. And so Mesh Mixer is a very simplified version that they put out for, for simple tasks. Well, you know, even the Mesh Mixer version is, is more complicated than we really even need as dentists, but it does a lot of the tasks that you'll be doing every single day very, very well. Uh, I would say the thing that Mesh Mixer does the best is it makes models. So you can take a scan in whatever, whatever 3D scanner that you have, you can export that scan as an STL file, uh, stereolithography, and, and the STL file gets imported into Mesh Mixer, and now you can, you can play with it, right? You can, you can take away the rough edges of your scan, you know, if your assistants or whomever scanned it, and then it's got those jagged edges that you just hate. You can smooth that up, you can put a nice, a digital 3D base on it. You can make it into a shape that you can then export into your printer software to print, right? Um, and so that's, Mesh Mixer is one that you really wanna spend some time with learning. Uh, you really wanna get good at it no matter what you do. I don't care. Uh, there's always an instance where you could do improve something by using Mesh Mixer, okay? Uh, it's just a, it's a, it's a tool you're gonna want in your software tool belt when you get into this, okay? Um, now, what's a good, the second one? The, the one that we probably use is our biggest workhorse, number two in our practice. Um, it's a software called Blue Sky Plan. Now, Blue Sky, it's uh, the software, the Blue Sky Plan comes from a, an implant company called Blue Sky Bio. And I believe the software was first rolled out because you know dentists were wanting to make their own implant surgical guides and i will say that it makes a tremendous implant surgical guide um, you know there's a lot of other softwares out there that do that now there's uh you know there's uh exocad there's three shapes stuff like that but those softwares carry a really hefty front end price tag the way that blue sky works is it's got a, an interesting pricing model. So they're, they're not like nonprofit, so they do wanna make a profit, but they don't charge you a dime for the software on the front end. What they will do is they'll let you design anything you want for free, and I believe that some of the modules in there, like you can make a model in there also, just like you can Mesh Mixer. I think that doesn't cost you anything. 
Um, they even have, I believe, a crown maker in there that maybe is very inexpensive if it's not free. Uh, but let's say you make a denture or a case, an orthodontic case or something. You get ready to export your files so that you can send it to your printer software to print. Then they charge you what they call an export fee. And they charge that. It's usually uh, $25. Some of the things you export that are not super complicated, they may only charge you a half credit, which is uh, $12 and a half dollars. So you're paying every single time that you export a case. But if you design the case and you just want to play with it or understand it or learn it, they don't even charge you for that. You know, you, as long as you're not exporting it to print, you don't have to pay for it at all. Uh, and some of these other softwares we talked about, you know, they're, they're charging four or five, six thousand dollars on the front end and some of them even have monthly or yearly annual fees. So that's a lot of money. That's a lot of twenty-five dollar exports, right? So uh, you know at this time we're making all of our dentures with Blue Sky. We're making all of our implant surgical guides with Blue Sky. Um, we're 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 making some of our crowns with Blue Sky. It's just a, it's been a, an amazing software. We love it. Uh, they sponsor some of our live workshops by giving all the attendees $250 worth of free free exports every time they take one of our classes. Uh, that's just a bonus. Um, and so, yeah, we love those guys. Uh, it's a great company. Uh, one of their vice presidents is another great lecturer, uh, Corey Glenn. He's uh, he's another guy that went to school at the University of Tennessee, and I followed him extensively. He's a he's a real genius in this area. So. So yeah, Blue Sky is a big winner of a company. Uh, so then you're wondering, okay, that's two good companies. Who's the third one, right? Sort of a new new kid on the block when it comes to free 3D printing dental software. Uh, before I get to that third one, the third one, the new one, that is cool too, and I'll tell you why. Real quick, hey, I'll tell you, if you're interested, if you're interested in 3D printing, you're watching this video, we've really got something I think that's special for you. So at the 3D Printing Association for Dentists, at our website, we have got three checklists. This checklist that we use every day in my practice, it's our checklist um, on how to do clear liners with 3D printing, how to do immediate dentures with 3D printing, and also how to do implant surgical guides with 3D printing. You can have those three checklists for total free, absolutely free, if you go to 3dpa.org, and just there you'll see where you get your free checklist, sign up, you'll get your free checklist sent to you, and uh, you can have those. Those are totally free to help you on your journey as you become a better dentist with 3D printing. Okay, so grab your checklist. And uh, so now let's talk about the third free dental software. So sort of a new player on the block, a new one that's come into town um, is a company called Medit. And so let me preface this by saying, I'm, I'm telling you guys this at the end of 2022, as fast as software improves or declines or gets bought out, Things may have changed when you're watching this video, but in 2022, at the end of 2022, Medit is really cool because I didn't even know this existed until I purchased a Medit scanner, okay? And when we started using the Medit scanner, we downloaded the Medit suite of software, and I just had thought it probably just came with a scanner, but it turns out it's actually a free software that anyone can use whether they have a Medit scanner or not, and it's also free. And this software has got a lot of different modules. I would call it a suite of software, okay? Um, and so they do things like make models and, and splints. They do a really good job. Their splint software is outstanding. Um, and so that's a really good one. Um, and then, but the one that really caught my eye that I really like, they have a, a temporary and, a, and, and um, they're getting a crown module. And so, you can actually do something, and this is a really cool thing you can now do to save time chair side and also reduce your, in, reduce your dependence on polyvinyl siloxane, all right? So we're all looking for ways to save costs. If you're already into 3D printing, you can take a pre-op scan of someone's you know, lower jaw, say. If you're prepping number 19 for a crown later today, you could have your 3D printing technology expert go ahead knock out a design for a sort of a shell temporary, a pre-made shell temporary for number 19. You can tell the software how much you want to reduce it and how thin you want it to be and all this stuff that's really amazing. And so when you start the procedure, just sitting there instead of your assistant having to take a, a pre-op impression of, with PVS or something and then doing a post, uh, you know, a post prep temporary for you out of acrylic, bisacryl, now you've got your 3D printed shell crown just sitting there. 
you can prep the tooth, fill it up with cement, plop it on there, you know, and usually they, they fit great with minimal uh, adjustments, right? So that's a really cool thing Medit does. And once again, like I said, they're free too. And we also are using Medit for some of our splints. I mean, they have really good splint software. Um, and so there are some splint softwares that are expensive out there. And there's also, you know, some people just use design services. But if you want a really good free software that's easy for you to use, this, you might want to check out Medit. So there you go. Mesh Mixer, Blue Sky, and Medit. Um, and these are all, these are all, these are all going to be very important uh, bullets uh, that you can pull out and use anytime that you get ready to use it as part of your 3D printing armamentarium. Okay. All right, everybody. Well, thanks. Uh, thanks for hanging with us. Um, obviously, we didn't cover every single thing on this topic, but if you follow us along on this channel uh, and follow the 3D Printing Association for Dentists, we'll be sending out more and more updates as we go along. And good luck. And we can't wait to see how, how you get 3D printing started in your practice.